remember what the haters talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? It's official. The results are in. There is no debate. Florida has the most concentrated number of crazies. We have an alleged drunk driver in Florida who initially declined a breathalyzer test telling a deputy sheriff, you didn't pull me over, I pulled you over. 63-year-old Juan Zamora gave the puzzling response after flashing his headlights at a Marion County Sheriff's deputy squad car in Ocola in order to ask for directions to an auto parts store, an arrest report said. The deputy stopped and smelled alcohol as he questioned Zamora, who had a 15-year-old passenger in the car and bloodshot eyes. Zamora allegedly admitted to downing two shots of bourbon earlier in the day. He also blew just over a 0.8 on his breathalyzer. Authorities later found a bottle of whiskey in his car and a white substance that tested positive for cocaine. He was charged with DUI and possession of cocaine. The mug shot alone should get him locked up for a minimum of 15 years. What a scary looking dude. Man. He better not try to defend it. He better, he better plead guilty. <laughs> this dude stopped the police. He pulled over the police. This is just one incident in his life, family. Y'all do realize this. Imagine a person like that. What type of other crazy things, outrageous things that they've done in their life already? This dude is 63 years old, so you know he has a plethora of stories. Florida, I want you to know I'm not picking on you. I really wish that I could make this stuff up. I wish that I was going around digging, just trying to find a story on Florida because we need some balance. I have no motive to single out Florida other than they're allowing George Zimmerman to exist there. But other than that, I have no reason to single out Florida. But Florida, man, it is something about your state. You draw the wildest, craziest, most insane, idiotic, asinine people in the world. And I know not all of them are born Floridians, but damn, it's a whole lot of them that migrate there. Story after story after story after story. Florida. And I'm going to tell you something. This is just one wild story on Florida, Florida today. Every day, you got to pick which Florida story you're going to tell. Sometimes the stories are so crazy, they demand that you tell more than one of the stories. Man, this is absolutely nuts. And he had a 15-year-old passenger in the car with him. Yeah, something is really wrong with this dude. I'm glad that he turned himself in, basically, snitched on himself before he killed somebody because as wild and crazy and hilarious to an extent that this story is, drinking and driving is no joke. People out here drinking and getting behind the wheel of vehicles every day and they are murdering people. So when these type of uh, crimes happen, I don't think that they should be deemed accidents.
This idiot had a 15-year-old kid in the car with him, and he offered no protection. 100% neglect. I'm just glad he turned himself in before he killed somebody. Juan Zamora, your mama should be embarrassed and your daddy should have pulled out. No more talk. What the ladies talking about?